All right, so here's another one that they asked is right from down your alley. You know, since you're, you know, writer, director, all that good shit wrapped into one. What's one show that if you could, you would reboot? First thing that came to mind, I would reboot The Cosby Show. Really? Yes. And here's why. I don't know if you remember hearing about it. It, it was a rumor at first, but then it started to become true because it got picked up. Uh, Will Smith's old show, The Fresh Prince of, Fresh Prince of Bel-Air. Mm-hmm. They were going to remake it, and it's going to be a grittier, they have. more it's, hard. Uh, it's, it's called Bel-Air. Air. It's going to be on Peacock. Yeah. I would do something similar with The Cosby Show because all of them were... It was a good show, so I take nothing away from that, but they were a little bit too clean cut, too nice guy image. I would make them a little more urban, shall we say. And I would make the problems and the situations that they face a lot deeper. You still gonna bring a message every week. You still gonna have a little more fun with it, but I would just bring it a little bit more into modern day reality, the things that we see and face every day. For me, I got two shows. I'm gonna go current and way back when. Current, I bring the Carmichael show back. I don't like how it abruptly ended because NBC wanted to short change how many episodes. Uh, they didn't, it should still be on right now. So I would bring that back because that was a well written, good, funny black show. Um, back when I was younger, this may surprise you. I would take it back to the essence of when it was funny and not so dark. I think it got like over, I think it got like over serious and that's when it ended up getting it canceled. But I would bring Rock back. Man, Rock was a good show. Remember in the beginning, it was, it was good. It had its deep moments, but it was lighthearted toward the end it just got like too serious so I think it turned people off so I bring it back and pull it back a few steps to where it wouldn't be such a a gut wrenching show to where you just it go off and you shed tears or something you know cause it's just in your face what's going on in the world I still keep it to where it's you know educated funny and deal with things but I wouldn't cause remember toward the end it was just it was so hard. It was like, this ain't no comedy no more. Yeah. It, you know, this is, you know, they, it just got too serious. Now, I know we mentioned a lot of comedies. I got one more. And this was also on Fox around that same time. And I don't know if you remember. It was a police detective show called Fast Lane with uh, Bill Bellamy. I love that show with Bill Bellamy. Yes. That show was, that. I love that show. By the way, I do have it on DVD, the complete series, which only lasted two seasons, but hey. Um, it should have got renewed and kept going. Bill Bellamy actually did a good job on that show. Yeah, um, it, it turned out, I believe, that uh, it was due to money that it didn't get renewed because of the cost of production. I will, by the way, shame the self-promotion, I will be doing a Rewind Relive review on that on the other YouTube channel on that show coming up real soon because that that was a good ass show. Yeah, I would bring it back. I hate that it uh it got canceled the way it did. But it's, so many shows have been canceled shouldn't have been. Yeah. Those are just two off the top of my head. Um, I'm trying to think if I can think of another one. There's like two or three others I can't think of the name of them. I got them in my head. I can see the people. Just can't think of the names that should have never got canceled. But you know. Unfortunately, raiding, raiding, raiding shit happen. 